And magic is just that. She's a magical being. And uh, there was a little glitch when I asked uh, Corky to put magic in the program. We did. We put, a, you have a copy of her poem that she wrote for me in your program. But unfortunately, her name didn't get put on the program. But so I, I am honoring her for this time and asking her to please come and read her poem. Yay! Woohoo! If you want to, you can follow along. You've got your own copy. Can you all hear me? Yes. It's Dottie's 81st birthday, and I'm here to bless her with good health and wishes. As she keeps sharing, giving such caring, good connections, strong faith, and even kisses. In her sermons, I'm always strongly impacted spiritually by her loving, giving, and compassion. Like at a recently happy service, suggesting we each grow and put all our love into action. What initiated my insights here into her powerful nourishment of feelings of love, my daddy shares how we all must love ourselves first, so we always feel we fit anywhere like that glove. She tells us to enjoy each precious moment, nourish ourselves and others every single day. She teaches we must give our love to others so they understand the specialness in every way. I don't know if she's aware how her teaching gives us all such powerful spirituals, electrical spark, that transform our spirit and lightness every day as we slowly come out of the deep and the dark. A woman on a committed mission is what I see as she strives to achieve a powerful destiny by being an example on how to move life's huge mountains to help us grow strong spiritually. Time to turn the page. <laughs> she personally demonstrates each day a huge difference in people's lives, we all agree. She easily helps us through life's predicament so we can easily transcend any difficulty. When complimented her teaching, she merely shrugs, smiles, and snickers a bit and says with embarrassment, hey, I care and only do what works. Don't have a hissy <laughs> I sense her motivation and wanting to help support her parishioners and all others. That comes from deep down in her soul as she gives willingly, just like a spiritual lover. Words you describe her are difficult and is all just so much guessing and conjecture. I'll slow down with embarrassing compliments here because I don't want her to give me a lecture. <laughs> she is a rare and most sensitive being sensitive person, loving, insightful, psychic, and bold. She's warm, giving, and oh yes, has a wonderful, warm, life cold. Many times it seems as if a million people want to draw around her buzzing like bees. They know that through her passionate and personal spiritual examples of life's secret case. Daddy's nurturing awakens our best human and powerful tendencies as a giving conjures up our most fond and kindest memories of all the time she championed us in our mind course corrections. She always gives us strong, supportive, and uplifting connection. Daddy touches you in places not too many people are willing to go. She genuinely responds to you with love and then simply goes with the flow. She hears you, she sees you, and then gives you big hugs. And definitely supports you with her always honest, non-judgmental love. Her personality and sense of humor are, are also <coughs> mostly beyond funny. When sharing her sense of humor, guess what? She doesn't even charge you any money. <laughs> I'm always amazed and touched by her huge capacity for love and generosity, and impressed by her loving, wondrous, unique, and brilliant tenacity. 
Just knowing her, she makes a huge difference for you by merely being in her presence, which can't help but touch and heal your also broken heart, subtle defenses. You can thank Dottie by truly living through her own life's adventurous examples, you see. By just simply being here, she lights up our lives for now and up all eternity. <laughs> so Dottie, let me wish you another great spiritual and loving adventure for the two of 19 and 20, 20 years. And that you'll draw happiness, connections with your people, and continue to rev up our happy spiritual gears. <laughs> Wherever your journey in life may take you, I pray you'll always be safe and enjoy the ride. And never forget your way back home. Your people are always here on your side. Thank you, God. It's okay to cry. Absolutely. Thank you, Marge. Happy birthday. I mean, is that so true? Yes, it is.